Hi, welcome back guys. Today I am back with another new video. In this video, I will discuss with a very interesting lead code heart problem. So basically this type of question asks in many interview. So please watch this video at the end. You will learn lots of things. So let's start the video. First discuss the question. Question is the right a SQL query to find out call duration for every calls. Okay, so basic I have to find in minutes for every calls. So basically I have two tables are given. So call start table and second one is the call end table. Okay, so basically here you can see that for call start table phone number is the contact underscore one and start time are there and call in also contact underscore one phone number and end time are there. So basically we have to join the two table and we'll get the this type of output like so here you can see the contact one for start time is the 10 20 and end time 10 45 so duration in for the call in minute is 25 minute for contact id one so basically is the main uh, problem are there so how you can know which one is the like because both are the contact one because if you join for contact one and this contact one so this contact word one join with the this contact uh, two contact underscore one so how we can like distinguish which is the call start and which one is the call end okay so let's start the video okay so first i have to run the two tables are there call start table and call end table so here you can see that for contact underscore one start time is a 10 20 and this one is a 10 45 okay so i think this one is the joining call and for contact underscore one this is the start time is a 4 25 and this one is the five uh, five hour like uh, 17 point zero five so 5 uh, pm and 5 minutes okay so how we can join for this uh, contact and this contact okay so first i have to find out the row number okay how i how i can find the row number row number i have to use over and i have to use partition by because i will see i will show you because all the phone number is different okay so if i use partition so this uh, contact underscore one is the one partition this is the another and this one is the another partition okay so i have to use over partition by partition by partition by i have to use the phone number phone underscore number and i have to use order by also because i don't know which one is the first order so that's why i have to use order by order by order by start time start underscore time so i have to give as as row number so if i run this query i will get the row num um, if i run this query i will get the row number so here you can see the for contact underscore one this is the first call this is the 10 20 so this one is the one this was the uh, this one is the uh, 425 so this one is the row number one so basically the ascending order i will get the row number so same i have to do for the call n also okay so i have to use here row number row number row number i have to use over clause and i have to same as partition so partition by phone number and order by n time okay so i have to use partition by phone number and order by order by n time order by n time so these all also rn as rn so if i run this query i will get the for the this is the call n table for all the row numbers so here you can see this call n 1045 and this call is the n 75 so for contact id 2 this call n is the 1255 and this one is the 1020 for the contact id 3 so i will make as this one as a ct so i have to use ct ct1 as and i have to make this one as a ct2 okay see ct as this so i have to join for ct1 and ct2 with a phone number and row number okay so let's start select from ct1 ct1 inner join inner join ct2 okay based on on based on ct dot uh, this one phone number so I have to use ct1 dot phone number equals to ct2 dot phone number and 
I have to use join with uh, row number is a very important because if I not join row number, so is the like contact ID one join with uh, two times. So okay, I will get the wrong uh, output. So I have to use ct one dot row number equals to ct two dot row number, and I have to use the star. So if I run this query, I will get the. So here you can see that. For contact ID one start time is the ten twenty and this one end with the ten forty five. So here you can see the con uh, join with the contact underscore one contact underscore one and row number one and here you can see row number one. Okay, so I have to need only ct one dot. I have to use like phone number and ct one dot start time and ct two dot end time. Okay, so here I will filter the column so I will get the phone number start time end time now i have to find the duration between this call and this call okay so one function are there is the date div function date div function you have to pass the parameter as the which interval i want i want minute and have to pass the like start time start time and end time end time and column name as duration duration in minute duration in minute so if i run this query i will get the expected output so here you can see that for contact underscore one this call start 10 20 and this call in 10 45 so i'll get the duration in minute 25 minute for here you can see for contact id 3 this call start as 9 20 as 9 40 so duration is the 20 minute so i hope you understand from this video if you like this video please hit the like button if you visit this channel first time please subscribe this channel We'll meet again. Goodbye.